here we are with Jujutsu Kaisen episode 9. And yeah, last episode we got new characters introduced, uh, Toto and Mai, which are from the Tokyo school, I think, and are third years. So yeah, I guess it will be interesting to see more about them. And we also saw the glasses guy with the black weird glasses from the intro, so being with Itadori, so I guess it will be interesting to see what he's all about, right? Getting to know another new character. And we saw uh, Okotsu at the end of last episode. Which was also mentioned by Gojo, so it will also be interesting to see more about him, right? Right. <laughs> so yeah, if you like what you see, leave a like, subscribe, or comment. Let me know what you think, and I would say let's get to the episode. Oh. Oh, that's Okotsu. Oh. Oh god. God damn. So I, can, I guess he can be pretty vicious. Earth the warm man. Is this guy? Is this the same guys? Maybe you just look similar. Yeah, why even go to a movie and pay for it if you just talk the whole time? <clears throat> and it's ugly as fuck. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, it is the same, guys. <laughs> Big brain. <laughs> Is this a flashback? It's it feels like a flashback. Nah, I hated him.
Can I do the same? Huh. <clears throat> Is this maybe a flashback? How he got the powers? But I mean, we saw at the end of the episode that Itadori and the other guy were in front of the cinema too, right? Hmm. Maybe just coincident. Uh, co Maybe they go to the theater to watch a movie because of training? <laughs> Emotion training? Uh, I don't know. Hmm. I'm, I guess we will see. But that would mean that Okotsu had contact with the bad guy, right? Because I guess the white haired dude is the bad guy. <clears throat> Serve some right. Indeed. And they only see maybe this Okotsu going inside with the other three guys. Oh. No, it's it's not a flashback. Wait, what? <laughs> focus, focus. Nah. He seems practical. <laughs> okay. Here we go. X salary, man. So why is he wearing those glasses? <laughs> okay. Wow. <laughs> but <laughs> Let's go. Mm. 
very straightforward. <laughs> of course he doesn't care. Yep. Or someone that can hide his presence? Oh. Okay, here we go. Let's show some action. What can he do? Another one. <laughs> Is he using only weapons or also like curse techniques? Oh. Okay, he has normal eyes, okay. I was wondering if he has like normal eyes or not because of the glasses, but he has normal eyes. <clears throat> Maybe those are also glasses so that he can see curses. Maybe he also has no curse energy. <clears throat> like Maki. Oh, he has. Okay. Interesting. We <laughs> home run. Can't multitask. Ooh. <laughs> Good damn. Easy clap. All right. Seems like it's a... <laughs> The beat. Seems like this is a stronger curse, right? Because you can't just kill it like the other ones. Like the first one. Oh my god, Gojo? Oh. 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 
Dude, the... This looks dope. Well, the OC is so good. Oh. So he's... He becomes very strong. Oh, the look on his face. <clears throat> so basically, his normal punch is already like... <clears throat> his normal punch is already like 120% stronger than normal. Sorcerer. And then comes the after punch. Humans. Right? Okay, so the enemy, the villain, has the power to turn people into curses? Mm-hmm. Okay. That pisses him off. <clears throat> Dude, this sounds like that's a bad thing. Let's go loud. Potential special grade. I wonder when we will see the first time when we will see the first time Sukuna taking over. I have to rewatch this part. Okay. Maybe not actual.
So it's not Okotsu. I guess that makes sense, right? <laughs> Keep it a secret. Wow. All right. <laughs> okay. I really thought that was Okotsu. Oh, why the curses? Deep. I skip. <laughs> Dick. <laughs> what the fuck? Okay, that was episode. Let me know what you think. But yeah, it was an interesting episode, right? I th I first thought that the that the boy was Okotsu, right? But it turns out it's not. Right? Or maybe this. And they just don't say it or he's undercover or something. Or maybe he's not. I don't know. I'm confused about that part. Didn't they in the last episode? No. I don't know. Man, I'm confused. <laughs> if it's Okotsu or not. Um, but yeah. <clears throat> then interesting to see like the power of the guy with the glasses. Is, I forgot his name again. Very interesting. Like he can divide the length of an enemy by in tenth, right? So that it has like ten um path and if he can hit like the seventh i think the exact spot then he can deal way more damage it's like a critic a critical hit basically which is very interesting right i mean even if you are like weak you can still be very strong if you hit this precise spot all the time basically so all you would need really is like good reflexes right so that you don't get hit by a stronger opponent and then if you can like dodge and everything as long as you can dodge and hit your hits you can pretty much be strong and win right and also interesting explanation explanation about um itadori's power that his curse energy is basically like lagging it's like behind his actual movement because it can't keep up with him basically I guess because, like they said, he's like basically superhuman strong and already his normal hit with barely any curse energy or like with only little curse energy is already like 120% as strong as like an average sorcerer. So already that's stronger than average. And then the aftershock comes in from the hit 
that has a curse energy, which is even more brutal. So that's pretty crazy if you think about it. <laughs> Can't wait to see more about that, right? Once we get Itadori like being stronger and more trained and everything, man, that would be dope. And so, yeah, Glass Guy now sends Itadori on a goose chase, basically. And while Itadori is following the kit, um, he will go after the true culprit. Because the true culprit left footsteps behind that they can track, like, from the curse energy that is, like, leftovers, rests, whatever. Um, and we'll follow those to go to him. So, yeah, I guess next episode will be very interesting, right? And that's basically it. I mean, we didn't saw anything about uh, Megumi or uh, Nobara. Only a bit of uh, Gojo with his sunglasses and a t-shirt. Uh, so, yeah. Next episode will be interesting, I guess. But, yeah, if you like what you saw, leave a like, subscribe, or comment. Let me know what you think. And I would say thanks for watching. Until next time. Bye-bye.